بیندای ارجمند امروز یک شنبه است تاریخ بیستون و ما در منطقه میجور مکس هستیم و غرب سرک ویستون امروز خوشبختانه باز هم شاید یکی از کارهای بسیار خوب و نیک از هموطنان خود هستیم هموطنان عزیز ما که امروز تحصیل کردن دانش ها مختن و امروز ما نتیجه دانش و تحصیلشان از چشم سر میبینیم خانواده زمانی امروز در تورنتو نام خدا با کسب علم و تحصیل زبان زده همگی هست در هر بخش که بینیم امروز ما زمانی های عزیز هم میبینیم فرید زمانی علی جان زمانی بقیه نامشان یاد ندارم اگر از من آذر دنشن و امروز شاهد گشایش مدیکل سنتر پیوند هستیم و امروز خوشحال هستیم که داکتر سه پیوند جوان بیسا مبتکر جوان بیسا خوب با تحصیل ابتکار گشایش اولی مدیکل سنتر جامعه افغانی ما را در تورنتو دارن که ما به نمایندگی از تلویزیون جانی امید 24 این موفقیت برشان تبریک میگم از زبین نازنین تشکر میکنم که فلم بخش مرا فلم برداری کردن ما کش میکنیم که یک گزارش بسیار خوب تهیه کنیم منتظر عزیزیم که تا حال اگر ما شاهد گشایش سوپر مارکت ها بودیم بزنس ها بودیم ولی بسیار خوشحال هستیم که برای اولین بار ما میبینیم که مدیکل سنتر ما خود داریم این موفقیت برای تمام هموطنان خود تبریک میگم و مخصوصا بر دکتر سیپاون در ادامه با ما باشین در گزارش از افتتاح کلینیک پایوان تشکر خب بیندای گرامی تا جایی که میبینین انبطنان ما از هر گوشی شهر آمدن تا شاهد گشایش ای کلینیک خود ما باشند در جمع میمان ها میبینیم که آقای فرمولی سیف هم حضور به هم رسند در جمع فرمولی سیف سلام علیکم سلام بر شما سلام بر حضور مجلس که امروز در گشایش یک کلینیک هموطن ما همدیار ما همزبان ما و افتخارش به ما برمیگرده و کمیلیتی برمیگرده و جامعه برمیگرده که روز تا روز متخصصین ما کارشناسای ما در هر رشته افتخار آفرین هستند و امید آفرین هستند و دکتر سه پیوند و جمع فامیل و اعضای کلینیک که در یک موقعیت خوب در یک موقعیت بسیار مناسب و در موقعیت بسیار جدید امیدوار هستم که موفق باشند و تمام پشتیبانی کومینیتی خودش برخوردار باشن فراموش نکنین آدرس و پرکتس و رشته های تخصصی داکتر سیب فامیلی پرکتس داکتر هستند و بر از موفقیت های مزید را آرزو میکنم در قطار سائر جوان های ما که یکی بعد دیگر به ای خانوار بزرگ علمی میپیوندن تشکر از شما تشکر از امید بستو چا زنده باش بیویجی بر شما سلام تقدیم میکنیم علیکم با سلام نسیر جان چطور هستیم خوشحال هستیم که شما رو میبینیم زنده باشی سلامت باشی و شما هم روز کلینیک دین که افتتا شد می توانید بگید کلینیک از کی است؟ کلینیک از دکتر حسن پیوندی پسر پسر دومگی نام خدا یعنی بینده گرامی تا حال از دکتر حسن پیوندی گفتیم از علی جان گفتیم از فری جان گفتیم و بعد دیگه نامای دیگه شما رو یاد ندارم داو جان رزا جان بله بله خب کل شما نام خدا در یک کار هستین و نتیجه زحمات زیادتر باید بگویم که بی بی حاجیز که و دعاهایی که اینا کردن و متعمل جای کشیدن زحمات کشیدن ما برای شما تبریک میگم که این مفقیت تبریک میگم مفقیت فرزندار تبریک برسان میگم دیگه شما هم اگر برای جواب شما هم خوش آمدین بسیار زیاد خوش آمدین زحمت کشیدین زحمت های رو ببخشین از کل بیادر های عزیز نازنینم تشکر یک جخان از کلشان که زحمت کشیده از کل لگی زنده باشین از آرس های نازنینم تشکر که در کنار ماست در کنار شورای خدا است این رای شورای شان موفق باشه با کنار خانم های شان خانم شان موفق باشه یعنی یک موفق بود شما خوش هستین دیگه چرا آرام دخترای ما سر ستایشان چرا خوش نیستم خوش هستم خداوند خوشی های تان افزون داشته باشه تشکر زنده باشی تشکر شما چطور احساس تان چطور از راجع به افتتاح کلینیک تشکر زنده باشیم بسیار خوش هستیم اکساید داشتیم که اولی کلینیک ما و شما در سطح تورنتو برای بار اول این جای افتخار است بسیار زیاد تشکر زنده باشین تشکر زنده باشین
افتتای کلینیک بر فرید جان فامیلشان برای مگی تبریک میگم جان تشکر یک جهان از آمدان تون زحمت کشیدی ببخشید زمتار یک جهان از آمدان تشکر من بر کل بچه های نازنین بر کل جوان های افغان بر کل افغان های عزیز خود تبریک میگم بر کل شو تبریکی افتخار هر چی که در مرکز ما میشه بر افتخار کل افغان است نه که بر یک دو تا تشکر یک جهان خب شما چه تبریکی میتونید میگین چی میگین بر دکتر صاحب پیوندی برای شان موفقیت میخوام چیزی خاصی نمیگم چیزی خاصی نمیگم که تبریک میگه خوی نمی خودش یک مسئله خاص است که ما امروز خوشبختانه که صاحب اولین کلینیک خود میشیم کلان افتخار از شما خور ما هم تشکر برشان تبریک میگیم نمیشالا همیشه کل جوان های ما موفق باشه جان جوری تندرستی موفقیت برش میخوایم زنده باشین تشکر خب بینده گرومی او تو که گفتیم ما در جریان گشایش کلینیک پیوند هستیم و جوان بسیار عزیزی را که در کنار ما میبینید دکتر صاحب پیوند هستند دکتر صاحب بسیار زیاد تشکر خوشحال هستیم که شما را با خود داریم ممنون اول خود یک سلامتان میتونیم به بینده گرومی و به تلویزیون امید 24 بگوین بعد از این رابطه به کلینیک از شما سوال بسیار زیاد سلام بینندگای عزیز ما پی دکتر پیوندی هستم از پیوند مدیکا سنتر الحمدلله تقریبا یک شش هفت ماه میشه که افتتاح کردیم که برای کامیونیتی ایوان بتونیم سرویس پرایمری کیر سرویس پروواید بکنیم و خیلی خوشحال هستم از اینکه میبینیم دوستان عزیز از جامعه افغانستان اینجا آمدند که ما را سپورت میکنند دکتر بسیار زیاد تشکر در اینجا چه کلینیک شامل چه کدام بخشا هست مختصر اگه بوین بود بعدن ما میتریم گزارش از لابلا بگیریم کلینیک فرمی فیزیشن هست و واقعی کلینیک که معمولا برای مریضا و پرامی کرسا میز پیدا پروباید میکنیم یعنی مریضا رو می آد رجسترم میکنیم به اضافه که کسایی که می آید برای واکین میبینیم که هر مشکلی داشته باشن مشکل های هلت معمولا بایشان چیز میکنیم دیل میکنیم منیج میکنیم در کنار از زو اینجا سپیشالیست هارتن داریم کاریولوجیست که می آید و مریضایی که نفر میکنیم در کنار از زو ما سرویس های دیگه که پروباید میکنیم ما فقط کنگور ما اید باشی نشان ما گزارش تیم میکنیم بازم بیده گرامی دکتر سای پایواندی افتخار دیگه برای جامعه افغان های ما در ترانتو خیلی خیلی زود کردیم خوربان زنده باید چهره بسیار آشنا جوان بسیار پرتلاش جوان مبتکر اونرمند اونر پیشه و اونر آفرین زمی جان بیاخر واقعا به خدمتگار راستین وطندار آفرین و خواهر ما هم یکی از بازوهای زبی جان هستند که شانه به شانه با اونا کار میکنند که برای شما هم مفقیت و روزو میکنند خورم تشکر البته امروز در هی پلازا بیندگرامی قسمی که شما میبینین امی بلدنگ فکر میکنم یا امی تعمیر نو ساخت است و چندین بزنس همزمان در اینجا افتتاح میشه که از اون آخر که میبینیم تا این قسمت که اینجا اوپن هاوس دادن و اینجا هم مدیکل سنتر است که شما میبینین و خوشحال هستیم که میبینیم هموطنان ما واقعا تو بسیار با شوق و با هشق و محبت اشتراک میکنن و تشویق میکنن یک دیگه خدا و امید ما نسل جوان است امید ما این جوان های عزیز ما در اینجا تحصیل کردن دانش کسب کردن و امروز ما نتیجه دانششان نتیجه زحماتشان رو میبینیم ما امیدوار هستیم که در تورنتو ما به زودی شاهد گشایش دیگه مراکزی باشیم که هموطنان ما جوانان ما اینجا فعالیت داشته باشن تا اینا سرمشق شون برای دیگه جوانان سرمشق شون برای دیگه هموطنان ما که 
ببینن که تحصیل چقدر فایده داره تحصیل چقدر مسئولیت داره در زندگی چقدر زندگی رو میتونه تغییر بده و امروزی جوانای ما نمونه های از تحصیل است مثلا خانواده زمانی عزیز All right, today we are here at the grand opening of uh, Paiwan uh, Medical Clinic. We are very excited uh, to be here and we are going to meet uh, Dr. Paiwandi today, today. And we're going to ask him some questions about what kind of treatments they do here and what kind of uh, um, programs they have in this clinic. So we are heading uh, towards uh, okay. Dr. Paiwandi. Th Hello, thank you so much. How are so you doing? I'm doing good, thank you. We so are very excited to be here in this grand opening and uh, we are very proud of you that you uh, have a great clinic uh, okay. that uh, for a great community in this uh, Vaughan uh, location. Mm -hmm. So uh, what kind of uh, treatments do you guys do in this uh Clinic. Okay. Firstly, thank you so much for coming. I'm really excited as well. I'm really happy that you guys are coming here to support us, and it is for the benefit of the whole community, including uh, our Afghan uh, community. Um, I am a family physician. Uh, obviously, the services which we provide here is based on the primary care services. That means that we're providing services to patients who walk-ins, as well as uh, family physicians, family uh, patients. So, patients are able to register with with me, and they will have. On ongoing continuity of care based on the needs which they have and obviously that's their healthcare needs. Um, uh, we have a lot of services here. I provide uh, a lab here as well which we actually take for the convenience of our patients. It's we welcome. take uh, um, yeah. a blood test, we can do bloods and I also have a primary uh, uh, a cardiologist who comes uh, in this place and see patients who require any kind of help. Uh, my plan is to also have, hopefully in the future, uh, other specialists such as um, endocrinologists uh, to provide services so I can have all in-campus uh, services in one center for the benefit of the patients and the ease of the, uh, the, uh, the, the services. Uh, we also provide uh, liquid nitrogen treatments for patients who require wart treatments. Uh, do you guys uh, still accept uh, new patients here? Uh? Yeah, yes, we do. Um, uh, my, my, uh, I do take new patients, and obviously it, uh, that means from the newborns up to elderly patients. Perfect. And why do you take guys? A look at uh, we're going to go for a quick tour, but yeah. why do you guys uh, select in this lo specific location for the clinic? Um, it's uh, I, from my understanding, that it was a very big Afghan community in this localities, and I do understand as well the fact that there's not that many Afghans uh, in this area who speaks Farsi. Um, so I decided to open in this area because it's uh, locations and the fact that there is a uh, our community based in this area and there is a need for for a family physician. Perfect. Indeed, this is a great location for all Afghans and Persian brothers and sisters here in this location, Vaughan especially. So we're going to go for a quick tour of the clinic and uh, Dr. Seb is going to show us what they have in here. Yeah, so that was the actual reception area which we have also the TV which is doing personalized advertising and uh, our big reception is stereo there with computers. This is uh, one of the exam rooms as you can see here. We have uh, EMR system as well and um, there's quite a few equipments which we have here mm -hmm. and for providing services to the patients and that is our bed coach where we do the examinations as well as uh, examining uh, patients blood pressures and uh, their uh, ears and throats. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, so we have about uh, five uh, rooms in this place. Um, this is another exam room, which is identical to the first one which we have. Same. Uh, yes, exactly the same, so and well ready. And this is the third one, a lot that's much, much bigger. In here we also have uh, our fridges, which is, contains all of the uh, vaccines, which we do provide uh, for a lot of patients, including travel vaccinations, actually. And this is for weighing uh, neonates, and we do provide some care services for wound uh, wound care. Mm -hmm. So that's another exam rooms, and this is one of the exam rooms where we have facility for taking bloods. And my uh, uh, my blood taking ladies, they are able to do bloods uh, every day from Monday to Saturday between nine nine o'clock until two thirty. This is specifically designed, this chair, for taking bloods uh, for patients. And that is the fridge which we keep. Uh, yeah, that's the centrifuge which uh, spins and centrifuges the blood, making it ready for uh, taking mm. away. I see. And that is obviously our sharp box. 
What are the hours of the clinic? The hours of the clinic is actually open, open, we are open seven days a week, uh, from nine o'clock until eight, and uh, Saturday from nine thirty to six o'clock, Sunday ten o'clock to two p.m. امی یک مصر فی توضیح خواست می خواستم دکتر شم که در عنوان نشست ایت واکینگ کلینیک و تا جایی که ما برداشت می است که آوای زمانی گفت می ایت فامیلی پرکتس آفیس هسته یعنی دکتر فامیلی هسته دکتر فامیلی تا واکینگ کلینیک از نگاه همی ذهنیت مریضی که ما هم یکی از اونا بودیم فرق می کنه یعنی در واکینگ کلینیک چندین دکتر می باشه و هر روز دکتر تغییر میکنه تقسیم اوقات است که جوالش فرق میکنه اما در فامیلی دکتر شما مشخص با یک نفر که فامیلی دکتر تان است و احساس راحت میکنین و احساس امو 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 امنیت خاطر فامیلی تان میکنین این از از او خاطر یک توضیح میخواستم با میلیسی آفرسی جواب شرط شد اوکی That's a very, very good question. Uh, sorry, I'm going to speak in English. That's fine. It will be a lot fine, easier yeah. for me to explain to you. Uh, you're absolutely right. There's a lot of places where are walking clinics, then the, in the, the continuity of care for that patient is interrupted. As a result, the, some of the subtle signs which you, a family practice and family doctors who actually can pick up will be missed because every time you see a different doctor. Uh, and, and that's one of the important things which a lot of people don't think about to why one of the question actually one of some of the patients may ask why do I need a family doctor family doctors the importance of the family doctors is the continuity of care and the fact that you can pick up pathologies or abnormalities at a lot earlier stages before it become problematic l l such as cancer for instance okay a lot of the times if you go to a walk-in clinic they will just treat you for that episode and then forget it whereas your family doctors will actually see the whole history and as a result they will be able to spot okay this is even though it's normal it could be actually abnormal thing mm -hmm. for these patients and that's why this even though you mentioned this says walk-in clinic actually my sign is says walk-in clinic and family practice mm -hmm. my primary services is uh, 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 family f family practice mm -hmm. not walking well that thank you and that's why okay, yeah, my yeah. concern was to raise that thank question. you so much for yeah. telling City of Vaughan weather. <laughs> Brought to you by, do we, we give some credit to the province maybe today? Since this year. Uh, the other people are just busy running now during an election campaign. But I just want to say how happy I am to be here uh, today to really celebrate something that is, uh, I think, uh, incredibly powerful and powerful and important. Um, many times we, we look at medicine and we look at uh, the study of the human being in, in various in silos. Like, in other words, we, we, we look at each individual and we think that there is a cure just for one part of the body and, and not the other. And I think what this what's happening today is that we're actually centering the city of Vaughan. We're centering the city of Vaughan because we recognize that ultimately the mind, the spirit, and the soul are all interconnected. Woo! Uh, this type of approach, and I say enlightened approach, uh, towards healthcare uh, that is going to solve so many of the challenges that we face uh, today in today's world. Uh, the minister will obviously speak uh, later about issues that he truly cares about, but I, I do want to say that in today's society, uh, there are a lot of people uh, looking for anchors, and uh, today's ceremony of this opening, this official opening of these uh, great centers, 
uh, speak to providing hope and opportunity uh, for those individuals who want to improve their personal lives. Good afternoon, everyone. Uh, I am also the MPP for Vaughan Woodbridge, and I'm proud to represent all of you and where you've decided to locate your business. Um, it truly is, uh, for me, humbling to be the representative for the people of Vaughan Woodbridge at Queen's Park and to be also the minister responsible for addictions and mental health for the province of Ontario. My background is in working with people. I was a practicing lawyer, but I also worked with people that suffered from addictions and mental health issues. And I'm spending a great deal of my time looking at building this structure for the province of Ontario that was really non-existent in the past. And so when I hear words like integration and developing systems that cooperate, it's really important to see that because in fact that is the way that we can help the most people with the best quality of service. And when we talk about health, we can't forget mental health. In the past, it's kind of been subsumed in the general health that's been provided with the services that have been provided by the, by the province. But now, for the first time, having a minister responsible for mental health and addictions, you'll see that we're looking at making investments to do and break down the system so that there are safe services provided to individuals, whether they're under the age of 12, from 12 to when they become young adults, to when they become seniors and seeing opportunities like this where health providers are coming together and developing service and like the mayor said beautifully service it's a vocation it's not about business it's about delivering services and being there for your fellow human being and that's what makes Woodbridge and Vaughn for me very special because we see it all the time through the spirit of generosity of people that give to organizations, grassroots organizations that are providing services, and the services, the service providers here in the city that go above and beyond giving people the service they need to make sure that they stay, stay healthy, not only physically, but what you've built and what you've put together, and whatever way I can assist in making sure that we support the work that you're doing here as well. So on behalf of the province of Ontario and myself, I'd like to provide this to you. I know there's five of you, so I think I'm going to have to get four more made. But um, if someone can accept this. Okay, that's it. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Wait, 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 wait. We still need a dentist. Go the other side. Can everybody just shift over just a little bit? Yes, come in here, I'll go. There you go. Nice, nice, nice. One straight line, one straight line. Go back, 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 back. Everyone in here. Look at this camera right here, camera right here. I'm dead. Okay, you start right here. Man, you're good. Let's get one for snap. Hey guys, I want one here. I'm the president of the Congo. <laughs> 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 yeah, of course. I'm telling you, why not? I'm close. <laughs> You're good. Everyone looking here at the end there? Looking here? Yeah. Great, thank you. Okay, let's go over to the papers. I don't want to get another one. Hold on a second, go back in the booth. Okay. President. Mr. President. So, 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 one more. Yeah, there you go. Everyone looking here? One, two, three. Okay. Thank you. 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 Okay, a piece of this ribbon we get 10% off for everybody. That's it. I think we have some refreshment. So we have some refreshment, feel free and some food. Yes. Yeah, enjoy yourself. Thank you everyone for coming once again. Yes.
And do the tour. <laughs> Let's see the good this way. These are the start uh, examination rooms. Mm -hmm. uh, classic as what you would see in the places. They have again more systems as well. Uh, we provide uh, also liquid nitrogen, so uh, services to the people who are housebound. I've got uh, blood taking fluid off for lobotomy, so we do actually take blood as well for our patients. Um, this is another exam room. That's the kitchens. Another exam room as well. These are our facility for taking blood. Um, that's my office. This is your office? Yep. So you got the corner one, that's good. That's the right. corner of that. <laughs> that should take a look outside. <laughs> so you'll notice the traffic is not as bad as it used to be. Yeah. <laughs> Mr. No, it's, Mr. Mayor, it's been building quite what will be your message for, this is our first uh, medical clinic for Afghan community. Do you have any things to say to for Afghan community regarding Well, obviously we wish the, the very best. I do that on behalf of 335,000 people who live in the, uh, the city of Vaughan. Uh, today for us is a fantastic day. And yeah, I want to welcome you to the city of Vaughan and I know that uh, you're going to do a phenomenal job providing excellent service uh, to everyone. And uh, as I said outside, this is a labor of love. It's uh, it's very meaningful work and people count on you and, uh, it's, and for that for me that's the most important thing in life how do you how do you make a contribution in, in your life and obviously I think you've chosen the right calling because it's uh, it's something that we all need here in the city so congratulations and thank I wish you the very best thank you so much and I'm really glad that you guys came to to our clinics or grand opening today and we are trying our best to provide the best services and we are actually open seven days a week to provide them long hours until 8 o'clock and during the uh, week uh, to provide the better service for all our patients. Well, I'm sure that the, the citizens of Vaughan appreciate that commitment. Thank you. Thank Thanks. you. You got it? Mm -hmm. Perfect. Okay, you got it? Okay, you got your first piece, okay? <laughs> you can have the first piece. Now, this is the... Congratulations, Thank you, guys. Thank you. Sock, I'm just hope that I'm not going to mess this up for you. But look at that. Precision at its very best. Wow, amazing. Thank you so much. Uh, it's uh, cake and frames, they go yep. together well. <laughs> Thank you. Do top bag of my chest? Over here. Do top bag of my Good, good. Thank you. Yeah, I don't see this. Yeah, no. Thank you. That is? Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. What is this? Uh, this? This is like bologna? Yeah, like bologna. Yeah. 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 Yeah.